it's going to be hard for O'Sullivan to get that ghastly error out of the back of his mind. believe it but he's got to hold himself together eight well what a time to get a very heavy Nine. contact although he's still on the black but not as he would have been the white stopped in its tracks there just watch this just jumped a little bit and the white didn't follow the red through but well you don't want anything awkward at this stage well i think this crucible crowd have really got caught 16. up in this match between these two terrific players Seventeen. They're enjoying every single ball that's potted here. Higgins has a new conviction about his game. He's proved his nerve not least to himself, by clearing up with 65 to win the last frame on the black to stay in the championship. No spot available for the pink. 23. The only problem here, if he plays for the black, it's not a good bunch of reds to go into with the pink at the back there, not helping. So it's a big shot, this. He'll have to play it with a lot of pace. He might still be able to get on the red to the left, but he probably will take the chance to go into them here. He's got a lot of bottle, this player, I'll tell you. 37. 38. Use the full width of the pocket. 45. That was just pure attention. He's such a smooth cueist. That was a straightforward pot. What a great chance for Ronnie O'Sullivan, but as we know at this stage, nothing straightforward. Eight. 
nine. The balls are set for a clearance, but can he do it in these very special circumstances? Sixteen. Seventeen. That sounded a little bit of a heavy contact as well. <laughs> Nineteen. Now, I'm not sure the two reds that are just above the pink, when Ronnie played the cannon previously, whether it's just tied them up. They might be available into the left corner. Well, maybe they weren't. That's why he played the cannon. They're available now. 25. 26. Thirty-two. Higgins wondering whether he's going to get another shot. Thirty-three. Thirty-nine. Mm. Troubles.